Now, let's turn to matters on the pitch, shall we? And Bristol City, well, they're in the news as well for that because they slipped further away from the Championship playoff places last night with a 2-0 defeat at Watford. That's five games now for them without a win. Better news for Swindon, though. They're moving up to fifth place in League One after a 4-2 win against Oldham at the county ground. Swindon's promotion hopes were kept well on track with a satisfying victory over Oldham. Billy Painter scored twice. Charlie Austin and Danny Ward took the score to 4-0. Oldham got two back, but Swindon extended their unbeaten run in the league to nine games and leapfrogged Millwall in the table. Compare that to... Charlie Austin's become something of a Swindon hero since joining from Paul. With Billy Painter, he's been responsible for over half their goals as they push for promotion. But they had to wait until the stroke of half-time to break the deadlock against struggling Oldham. It was Billy Painter with a superb strike from the edge of the area. A wonderful goal, and he's now scored six in six league matches since the turn of the year. And in the three minutes of stoppage time at the end of the half, Austin was brought down by Joe Jacobson. The referee said that was a penalty and another chance for Painter to add to his tally for the season. He beat Dean Brill, his third penalty in the new year. Oldham couldn't believe it. They were two down going into the break. And three minutes into the second half, it got even worse. Now it was Austin again to score goal number three. Three in the last four games for him and 11 in all this season. And as the hour approached, Swindon scored once more. Douglas put Danny Ward through. He beat the advancing Brill to score again. Ward's on loan from Bolton and this was the second goal of his loan spell. It was job done for Swindon, but they did allow Oldham back into it. Chris Taylor with the cross. And eventually it came for Joe Colbeck to score at the far post from an acute angle. It was Colbeck's first goal for Oldham, but time was running out for them. They did score again in the third minute of stoppage time. Colbeck with the hopeful cross. Keeper Smith didn't deal with it. Jason Price on loan for Millwall headed into the empty net. Swindon stay fifth and Oldham are above the drop zone, but only on goal difference. Swindon started the night in sixth place and have beaten in eight league games. However, having been held to draws in the last two matches, the Robins were keen to get back to winning ways against struggling Oldham. Despite playing second fiddle to the Latics for much of the opening period, it was the home side who took the lead shortly before the break with a really superb strike. Billy Painter upping his tally to 16 league goals for the season. And Swindon doubled the lead in added time at the end of the first half. The second of the evening came from the spot after Joe Jacobson's foul on Charlie Austin. Painter assumed responsibility to score again for his 19th of the campaign in all competitions. The hosts made it 3-0 just three minutes after the restart. Austin beat the offside trap to bag his 11th goal of a promising debut season in the Football League. And the away side's defence was ripped apart again, just short of the hour mark. This time it was Danny Ward who had a clear run on goal. The teenager who's on loan from Bolton, scoring for the second time in Swindon colours. Oldham were heading for their seventh away defeat in the league this season. But at least the visitors added some respectability to the scoreline with two late goals. Substitute Joe Colbeck pulled one back with his first for the club. Oldham second arrived deep into stoppage time and it was a gift from Phil Smith. Following Colbeck centre, Jason Price gratefully accepted the Swindon keeper's charity to find the target for the first time since he joined the Latics on loan from Millwall. Swindon secured their seventh win in eight home league games to really enhance their playoff prospects. Billy Painter took his league tally to 16 and paved the way for Swindon's move into fifth spot in League One. Four goals in the space of 13 minutes either side of half-time buried Oldham and extended an unbeaten league run to nine. 
Charlie Austin and Danny Ward joining Painter on the score sheet.